All right, guys, welcome back. Half fast 719. Uh, FedEx just dropped off a package for the truck for the drunken ram. It's hot outside, got the swamp cooler going inside. So, return service requested. Anyway, I guess there's been problems with uh, FedEx lately because it was supposed to be here on Cinco de Mayo and it wasn't. So, let's see. Let's see. Uh, let me right hand cut it. Man, the bags are bulletproof. Let's see. It'll be like a. Uh, let me, I'll be like, uh, what's his face? Um, Gail Banks. I'll be like, Sorry, Gail Banks. It's getting old. And uh, like I commented in one of the videos, you should uh, have somebody open your packages. All right, here we go. Part number DZ433301. Made in the China. So here we go. Let me uh, open this. Ow! Stupid steeples. What I get for talking about Gail Banks. So it looks like we got some bracketry, big old Torx tool, kind of cool. Uh oh, I think that's Loctite. Um, some destructions. Let's see here. Let's see. Instruction manual it says. Tailgate Assist Ram, 2000 or 1500, 2009 in current, 2500, 3500, 2010 in current, which that is 2010. 2010. Okay. So, thread lock tube, shock. These are all the parts that come with it, ball mount. Blind nut tool, which is a uh, a riv nut tool, I suppose. Um. Anyway, so a lot of videos out there of this, and I figure why not? That's the cable. It's the hydraulic assist. That's a Gatorade bottle. So it's thirsty. Plate a plate. That's kind of cool. Little bearing, ball bearing, spinny tool. <laughs> Interesting. Um, this is leaking here. What's going on here? It's leaking. I don't know why. Okay, so it looks like over tightening the nut cert can strip the threads and cause the nut cert to not to be non functional. So, I'm assuming just the insert tool. There is one, sorry, there's three quarters of an inch of the washer. Anyway, I don't know. Basically, you just put it on. Just put it on. You stick that there, that goes in there, that goes in there. Not sure if it requires. So, see wood. You just do it on this side. So we got this hole here. So you do it on this side so that that assist doesn't want to lift the tailgate out of this chingadera there. So anyway, looks like it goes from here to somewhere else. Sorry guys, I'm tired. I'm hot. Pooped. Ain't doing nothing all day. I'm just wore out. Okay, so that goes in there. That goes there. 
take that out. It's all different. So you take that out. Maybe this goes on the bottom because it's different than what I'm seeing here. As you all can see, that looks like that. That's the cable that goes there. This is there. So I'm assuming they want you to take the cable out. And then this will go on the bottom because it obviously can't go on the top because it will interfere with the cable. So, yada yada. Yeah, okay, here we go. So now they have it. That's the right piece right there. So yeah, it goes on the bottom. All right, let me get you set up. I'm gonna go and just swing it. Just to swing it. Cause I want to. Maybe I'll put some sunglasses on. It's bright out here. I'll get you guys set up on the tripod. It's the tripod I use. I don't know if there's a name on it. I bought it at the thrift store for like a dollar. Um, Titan QT11 or sorry, QT2 150. Alright, let me get you guys set up and then uh, we'll go ahead and uh, we'll get some sunglasses and get to work. I'll be back. Alright guys, got some shades. This crap's gonna get hot quick. So first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take this rib nut, stick this chingling in there, if it'll go. Doesn't look like it's gonna go. So I'm gonna have to tap it a little bit, a little love tap. Get a little hammer. My little nylon. Nylon mallet. So as you can see, this thing's got a pretty cool little bearing. You know it's for Dodge, because it's the shape of Chrysler. Washer and a washer. So the nut on it is a 10 millimeter and the uh, Allen head is a uh, is a uh, five millimeter. So what I'm gonna do is run the nut in, just holding this. I don't know if you can see it. Let me zoom in there. Tightening the nut, let that rest on the bumper, maybe. Just trying to keep it straight with the tailgate in the bed because it can twist and rock a little bit. So, you can feel it crushing, whatever you want to call it. I could use a uh, ratchet wrench. So once I feel about is my own judgment. Once I feel about 15 foot pounds of pressure on it, I'll stop and then that'll be it. Because right now I'm probably putting about five pounds of five foot pounds of pressure on it. So 
real live time. Let's see how this is going to work. Feel it getting tighter. It's about 15 foot pounds. Back this off. Back that out. And then I'm assuming put the ball on it, which I don't have a wrench for it already. Put a little Loctite on it. It's kind of cool, neat little thing. Probably end up keeping it. So this little Loctite. I'll get a wrench, probably a uh, half inch, 13. One, one idea. Don't be surprised if my uh, camera goes into a uh, Whatever, hot, heat, overheated, shut down. This is actually probably a 12 millimeter. I'm using a 13. It's a little loose, but that's all right. Using my Harbor Freight wrenches, or Harbor Freight long wrenches. Okay, that's that. Let's get you guys moved up to here. Gotta take that chingalingi out. Try it with this supplied wrench thing. That doesn't fit. Doesn't fit. Okay. Cool little idea, but <laughs> fail. Okay, battery cut off. The T forty five, or not the battery, the camera shut off. So. Loctite because there's already Loctite on here. Keep watching the camera. Okay, okay, is that really it? So if it were me, let me read the destructions real quick. I'll be back. Okay, that's what I was gonna do. I was gonna put the strut arm down on the bottom. Slapper on. And then 
That's done, that's done. That's done, that's done. That's done. That's something about this. Limiter, remove the outer tailgate torques, blah, 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 motion limiter. And remove the motion limiter, the flat retaining nut, taking off to remove the limiter, pry one edge, yada, yada, yada. Okay, let's see. So I'm assuming they're talking about this thing. So let's see. That thing right there, T45 again. Limiter thing. Let's see, I do it with a wrench. Just go get the tool. I'll be back. Don't overheat the camera. this see if that'll work take some lineman pliers spin it I think that's it that's pretty much it all it wants you to do is to get rid of that limiter for some reason thing it says failure to remove the bed limiter the limiter and install the cable clip will cause the cable to bind be caught between the blah 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 measure down on top of the cable three and a half inches where there's cable clip needs to start press the clip in with a pair of pliers which okay well, that matters, but anyway, let me. Uh, I guess that's it. No clue. Where's that I bent that. We got that. We got that. Let's see. Excuse me. Excuse me. That tool, however, is pretty cool. Here we go. This is live. This is live. You're live. Let's see what it does. Shuts. Hoses. Bada bing, bada boom. About 15 minutes, maybe 10 minutes or less. Sorry, guys. That's it. Make sure you guys, uh, Comment, subscribe, tell me what you guys think. Um, I only did the one because that's all they recommend. Uh, go check out One Anglin. He uh, did a uh, Fan Bams uh, Ford. I think it's an F350. He did uh, two of them, one on either side. And uh, I think it was a little overkill, but whatever is what it is. So, yeah, T45, Torx, a, uh, oh, that's a 14, so it is probably a 13. Half inch, 13 millimeter, 10 millimeter, 5 millimeter, uh, Allen wrench. 
and a little mallet and ratchet. And this thing I'm gonna keep some extra long tight. A hot freaking ratchet. And that's it guys. You guys let me know what you guys think. Quick little install. Finally got it. However, looks good. Everything's in there. Everything's concealed, I guess. Alright guys, guys let me know what you guys think. Comments in the comment below. I'll put a, I'll try to put a link for it in the description below. Just got it on eBay. It's like 16 bucks. Alright guys, that's gonna be it. Comment, subscribe, do what you guys do. Thanks for watching. Later.